we decided to add electric school buses to our fleet because we're looking for ways to teach students about what the future holds. And the EV world is one that's growing tremendously. We chose Lion um, after doing quite a bit of research, finding out the companies that had buses out there. As we did our research, it was evident um, that Lion had a good product and they knew what they were talking about. So in 2021, Lion brought a school bus to our school, our drivers, our board members, myself, um, our mechanic, were all able to see, feel, experience the electric bus and that's what made it um, an easy decision. The thing that I appreciate the most about the Lion C obviously is the dollar savings. Aside from that, it's a much more comfortable ride. My students will tell you that it doesn't bounce as much, it's not as noisy, it's roomier with the aisle in the middle. Even my drivers will say it's a smoother drive. I had a driver compare it to driving a Pinto in a Cadillac. Um, driving a diesel bus is like driving a Pinto and driving an electric bus is like driving a Cadillac. And I would have to agree with that. If, if I have to run a bus route, which I have to do from time to time, if there's an electric bus in the lot, that's what I'm driving because I'd drive this over a diesel any day. First thing, if you're thinking about getting an electric bus, um, you need to talk to your electric provider. Our buses are only used on our routes, and so the buses only need to charge at night. We program them that at 10 o'clock at night, they go on full charge, and in the morning when my bus drivers are, are there, the buses are fully charged at 100%. In the winter time when it's really cold, or in the summertime when it's really hot, we also charge them during the day, but it's a low amperage, five amps, just to keep the battery compartments cooled at a constant temperature and it's going to make your batteries last a lot longer and you're never going to have any issues with starting. What would be my advice to other school districts that might be considering this or maybe aren't even considering this? Um, my advice is you need to look into it. It's a great experience for the kids. It's a great experience for your bus drivers. We haven't even talked about the health um, concerns with the diesel. So you're also providing clean air to your bus drivers and your students. I believe the way diesel prices are going up, at some point, the cost of ownership of these is gonna be a lot less than the cost of a diesel. So if you're not doing electric buses now, you will be sometime in the future. And if you're scared because you don't know anything about it, that's okay, we took a leap of faith and we haven't regretted a moment of it.